My name is United Clans, and today is the first day on a whitelisted YouTuber server. Uh, in episode zero, you guys met some of the peeps from the Too Crafty server, and today we are all by our lonesome. And we are about to set off on this amplified islands world to find a home for ourselves. I left off in Captain Q's storage facility, so I will close that up. <clears throat> and in that episode zero, we got some basics. Um, chicken, things for a farm, a single bed, a single torch. So while we're here, while we're here in this district that's full of trees, I am going to run around, get myself some of the absolute basics, some tools, etc. And then guys, we will set off. Uh, a boat. A boat is one of the things I will get. And once I've got it, we will set off on an adventure to find a home and a place to build. I will be back with you. <clears throat> I guess I should keep you here. We're about to punch a tree. Sort of an iconic moment in Minecraft. Represents starting fresh. And that is what we've done. Okay, so now I'll get myself a boat and some tools and I will come back to you guys. Ooh. All right, guys, I am about to say goodbye. Thank you, Captain Q, for your hospitality. Went down to his mine, found a little iron, a little stone. We got some basics. Uh, we got most of what we need, at least, to set off on our own. You guys, I have a rough plan for that. Uh, my best bud, the guy I know best on this Minecraft server, is McMastodon, who you guys know from my Ark Survival Evolved series. Um, and when we were in the Nether Hub, I spotted a hub path that leads out to Mick's place and I figure if there's a spot to start looking for a place of my own I might as well head out to where he is and start looking from there so that's my rough plan uh, I believe this leads yes it does to the commercial district which uh, we passed through last episode and um, you can see some of the cool stuff that's going on here quite quite the cool archway work in progress by uh, by Q but um, I have, if you are, let's say this, if you are brand new to me, to watching me play Minecraft, you will have to excuse me because, um, because I am going to spend a big chunk of this episode talking to the people that have been watching me for a while, especially those that have been watching me play Minecraft. Uh, we left our single player world that I just returned to earlier this week, and in the last episode I was talking up the possibility of us ending up on a server and uh, in that time I was talking to a few people like D here on uh, uh, this server and some people over on Hypermine and the two crafty peeps offered me a spot they said they'd love me to come play with them and so I agreed but there are some caveats guys I love 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 our single player world the one with Ocean's Gate and Hollow Grove but the sad thing is I don't think I'll have time to do the amazing things I want to do here and keep up with that so that series may have to get sidelined but we will be back to it if this server isn't what i hope it will turn into um this server is a oh here's the portal perfect uh finding my way around on strange foreign place but yeah if this server isn't fun and active and doesn't provide the inspiration and uh yeah they sort of the inspiring builds if those aren't provided by this place and we're in the nether scary as always but if if playing here isn't what i hope it will be guys we have an amazing single player world we could return to but if it is everything i'm hoping it will be on this server then we will make some new friends we will absolutely do some builds ourselves, and we will be inspired by people like captain q all the awesome builds he's doing out at his place um so guys, that's my that's my caveat, and that's my promise, that if this place is dead, if there ain't nothing going on, if nobody's building cool stuff here, we might as well be back home. We might as well be playing all by our lonesome at Ocean's Gate. Why not, right? But if it is what I hope it is, and there are cool people and amazing inspiration, then good things are going to happen here. This place is going to be full of inspiration, I hope. So... I stumbled past Mick's place a while back. That 
Woogie. We'll have to we'll have to keep looking until we three one two. McMastodon. Okay, well let's just see what sort of trouble we can get ourselves in. No minecart, sadly. I didn't think to build one. So, and I have no idea how far Mix place is. I've never seen his place, never been there. Uh, I know he's not online because I tried sleeping in a bed and I was able to. And if you're on a server and uh, you can't sleep in a bed to get through the night unless everybody sleeps in a bed together. No, oh, not the same bed together. But uh, if everybody goes down to bed at the exact same time. Um, so this is it. Looks like we have found our way. It hasn't been too tough. Uh, let's see where we come out. I can't wait. Now, guys, I, uh, I'm just going to look off to the ocean. I have no idea if Mick has builds going on here that he doesn't want spoiled. So uh, I'll have a quick look around, and then I will pick a direction, probably north, whichever way north is, and we will go exploring in a boat to find an island of our own. Guys, Mick has some cool stuff going on. He has like a giant desert island. And I know the biomes do weird things. Uh, for those that don't know, the Too Crafty server is an amplified islands uh, seed. And, oh god, this is gonna hurt. Nope, okay, good. And I think, so Mick's place is up there. That is north. I think we're just going to set out north and see what the heck happens. We'll see. I'll find out which direction we're actually traveling. Alright guys, the good news is that by heading north and slightly west, we are moving away from spawn. You can see the negative uh, getting higher in both the, uh, the X and the Z, uh, which is awesome. This is still Mex Island, so we got a ways to go guys, and I imagine I am going to be exploring for quite a little while so uh i am gonna leave you i'm gonna take my first god dang it first break and i will come back to you uh when i find uh, a good candidate for an island we probably won't stop with the first one we find we're gonna keep looking and we're gonna see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves into this episode Ooh, 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 guys, we found our first thing. God dang, is there a lot of ocean in this place. Uh, somebody, a Wooga, who is on the server, she was saying that if I stumble on the ocean monument, I forget what it was. She said something like she, she I can help myself to tools at an ocean monument. And I hadn't planned on finding it. I didn't know where it was, and I had no idea if it's even got a nether hub point on it. But I see a big island over there. I see a little island over there. And this seems to be, this seems to be, yeah, let's have a look around here. Okay, get me up there. Beauty, boat's still here. Lord, where would tools be? Assuming that this is the spot. So yeah, it's been sealed off, glassed in. It does have another portal. So we just need a way down, which this might work as. We, we'll find out. Uh, I'm going to look around here. I'll come back to you. This might be it. This might be something. What you got on it? Help yourself. Oh. Oh, those are nice tools, though. Help yourself. I don't want to help myself. That feels too good. There's diamonds and stuff in here. And these are both on the verge of breaking, and they're enchanted, so I wouldn't touch those. And you know what? We got, we got tools. We'll find some things. Looting, that's valuable. Oh, no, I've got a good. It's fine. It's fine. Let's not take it. Guys, I didn't expect diamond. If there was iron, I would have loaded up my coffers and headed for... Oh, crap, it's nighttime. Okay, um, I'm going to see if there's a bed here. And if I find one, I will sleep. And if not, I'll hopefully be safe and we'll set out in the morning. I did it. I found a bed and off we go, guys. I think we've seen what there is to see here. I'm hesitant to steal those tools. Let's just try and find a way out. This doesn't look like a way out at all, does it? No. Definitely not. We came in over here. Oh. Lord. Uh, yes we did. Okay, perfect. And I believe my boat to be uh, up up this side somewhere. Uh-huh. 
All right, cool. Uh, I'm gonna go check out some of the nearby islands. I am excited to do that, and we'll see what we can find for ourselves. A little fun and excitement. Uh, that one. I wonder if anybody's built on it yet. I think I left my boat over here. I did. Okay, cool. Yeah, we get a little tiny island out that way. But I want to check out this big boy. I want to see what it what there is out here. Because, uh, in like, I'm not intimidated by the Amplified or by the islands, guys. Uh, my, home, my home base in my single-player world is basically an Amplified island. It's just a crazy tall savanna island. So this feels like home to me. Oh, God, that is a... Oh, this is going to be so crazy to build on. Oh, I don't know if the inspiration's hitting me. I'm not sure. Oh, and somebody's already here. Yeah, totally. Okay, I see a base right over there. Uh, so we will continue. I'll try and head north, head further north, and uh, I'll come back to you guys when I find the next thing on the path. Okay, Swamp Island. Interesting. Ooh, I've never built in a swamp. I've never set up base in a swamp. I've only ever visited and stayed for a very short amount of time. Because it's creepy with slimes. But there's usually lots of sheep, tons of clay, which is cool. Uh, oh, okay, here we go. It's finally amplifying. Oh, this might work. It seems so flat, but... Guys, that's an awesome plateau up there. Isn't it? And it's not all swamp. It's like a swamp birch combo. Let's, uh... Oh! God, why do you keep doing that, UTC? It's because shift is sprint in arc. <laughs> Out of the way, sheepy. I'm about to wreck ya. Okay. Oh, this might be some fun here. There might be some building we can do. This is, uh... This is a big, big island. Big, 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 big. Very big. Uh, oh, we're just wrecking lily pads as we go. Alright, let's do a full... Let's circumnavigate it. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Oh, we got dark oak here, too. We got dark oak, birch, oak. We'll just have to track down some jungle and some acacia. Yeah, this is massive, guys. This is a big, big, big freaking island. And look at this cove. I just hope we ain't found somebody already building here. Yeah, this cove is cool. I, I don't even know where we're, we're going to start out of all these these amazing little spots around the island. I mean, I gotta start small, right? Simple wood house, somewhere to put down a bed. Alright, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll keep circling, and when I find more, more glorious views on this mega island, I will let you know. This, I might be wrong, but this feels like new terrain generation. It feels like I'm the first person to come out here, and the first person to cause this to spawn in. I might be wrong, maybe somebody's visited before, but it feels like... This is being created in front of my eyes. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm barely halfway around this thing, guys. We got a long way to go. Uh, if this is the island, the question isn't if it is at this point. I think it's what part of it we build on. What part of it do we try and make home? Uh, and I want to see everything it has to offer before I pick one of those. At, right now, the dark oak, that little patch of dark oak, I could totally expand that and make that bigger. That's feeling like a good spot right now. But then there's a couple of these coves where the island wraps around. Yeah, this forested area is pretty pretty nice looking up here. And is that supposed to be plains? It might be. I wonder if horses spawn out here. This island's big, guys. This island might be too big for a UTC. I might not have the, the time or the energy to transform a spot this massive. Uh, wherever we stop, wherever we set up, it's likely going to be full of trees. And so we got a couple spots like that uh, around the edge of the island here. This certainly looks like one. If this is close, yeah, this looks like it, doesn't it, guys? That looks like home. That looks like home sweet freaking home. Oh, floating island. Keep spawning in. Keep spawning in. I want to see what lays ahead. Let's hop off. I feel like we're almost around the edge of the island, uh, and I want to explore on foot. Uh, I'm going to grab my boat just in case we decide this isn't the spot or this isn't the part of the island. So come with, whoop, there you go. Come with me, fool. 
For a moment, I thought those were torches up there, guys. I don't think they are. I think they're yellow flowers. I think this is a brand new island, and I think, being that we created it by traveling out here, I think it's ours. We'll find out shortly. If I stumble across somebody's base, we'll turn around, we'll keep looking. But right now, this island has a ton of different tree types, which apparently, in an amplified island's world, is really hard to find. It's got a horse, a white horse, at that. And... It's got some epic landscape. Oh, we got sunflower fields. This is home, guys. This is it. The question is just where where do we start? Uh, let's see if I can navigate on foot to where that dark oak forest was. I'm not sure if it's... I know it's on the this side of the island if I keep traveling this way. But, oh, more horses. Adorable. Let's see if we see dark oak. There's the dark oak. Okay. Okay, cool. So... A bunch of dark oak up there. Uh, let's head down into these plains. I got a good feeling about this spot over here. More horses, baby horses over there. Pretty cute. Oh, this this is good. I think this is perfect. I think I think we found it, guys. I don't know what I'll name this place, but know that when we start building here, we're gonna build like I built at Ocean's Gate. We're gonna role play it. We're really gonna get into it, and um, we're gonna build with creativity and with a story in mind yes there's the dark oak i think guys i think we just build a really simple house in this uh in this uh sunflower plains so let me go gather some supplies for that and i will come back to you and together we will build an amazing little house and it's getting dark and i haven't put my bed down because i don't know where i'm gonna live yet uh okay the day's running out on me quick, guys. I think... I think I just gotta hole up for the night. I don't think we'll have time to do a build this episode. We took a good bit of time exploring and coming out here, so I'm gonna dig myself into the side of a cave, and I'm gonna call it night, and god dang, I hope that whole forest doesn't burn down. Alright, guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Unite the Clans, and I will see you in episode 2 from the Two Crafty server in just a few days. Thanks for watching. A new day rises on Ocean's Gate. Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life with a brand new season of Minecraft. We are back, we are back here at Ocean's Glorious Gate, the place you all chose for me a year ago.